Yeah. He can take you all around the world. Yeah, I know he can take you places. I ain't finna take you no. From Lee? From the Bruce Lee? Back guys for some more Walking Dead. Alright guys. Alright. It's okay, Clementine. You can pet her. It's okay. Go ahead. Whoa. Boo! <laughs> Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. Tells that. What's this thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? <laughs> I don't know. She licked it. All right, let's check this place out, guys. Let's start from uh... yeah, I guess. Looks like a bunch of old, dirty clothes. Ooh, smells pretty foul. We oh, yeah, have some old clothes there. something behind this door I got a quick look they got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp don't get paranoid it's my job to be paranoid Lee I got my whole family on this farm right now how about you what about Clem she's <laughs> not actually family I'll protect her no matter what I know you will look that guy with Katya what's his name he locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So You're go right. find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Can to be more discreet? Like, yeah, I can take these off. Hey, Lee, you know how to pick a lock, right? Of course, no. I'm black. Would you say that? No. <laughs> well, I'm kidding, guys. I'm kidding. You know, urban. Oh, he's saying it. Oh, you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. He's saying, Lee, you're black. Hmm. We can do it. What? That's racist. See those screws? Instead of breaking the padlock, we can just take off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. Exactly. All right. Sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, I, th I thought that was Danny. Whatever. <laughs> can I have I thought it was Danny, too. Something? Hey, bitch. What's behind this door, Andy? Just tools. We keep it locked so the people in the woods don't try and grab them. Huh? We'd be dead without them. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. All right. We're going to do this, guys. There's something behind this door for sure.
Just stay close to your mom for now. Okay. Yeah, Doug. It's not safe here. I told you I don't trust these. But no. Everybody please me now. I had the feeling right away. It's a feeding trough. Good, uh, good saying, Lee. Nothing. And the last one. All right, we gotta get that door, but we need the screwdriver. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. Um. You got a screwdriver? For what? Uh, uh never mind. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. All right, he's gone. Now what? Still need a screwdriver. She looks skinny. How are the kids? They're doing okay. I never did thank you for saving Doc from the walkers back at Herschel's farm. No need, though. Gotcha. Andy will be back any minute. Please hurry. Yeah, what the fuck do you want me to do? I still can't get that lock off the door. Hmm. You probably just need a screwdriver or something. Yeah. Can you tell me where to find it? Alright, let's try to find one, guys. False alarm. I'm back. Yeah, let me just find the screwdriver. Um. Oh. <laughs> fucking Larry. So, how does a woman like yourself run this whole place? Oh, I manage just fine. Plus, I have my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. Ugly ass face. It's good for Larry though, you know. Alright guys, where are we gonna get a screwdriver? Was it one from here or something? Lily, you got a screwdriver? What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if it's up to me, we should just take our food and go. What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? Yeah. He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. They the are. I see it. We just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that to change. That's just how he is. Then fuck you and him. So, he's the asshole. Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes, I know that. But he's not a bad guy. He just... He's got a lot Yeah, whatever, we all got pain, bitch. He's been through so much. And lost... Pretty much everything. No excuse. And it's hardened him, you know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And me. 
All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. Don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. I'm judging you both. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. How do you feel about leaving the motor in? I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I'm gonna go check things out. Yeah. Watch yourself, Lee. Since you're useless anyway. No screwdriver. Need a damn screwdriver. Looks like a feeding station for the cow. Alright, maybe on the tool toolbox, yes. It's gotta be the only choice for It's a small toolbox. It's gotta be this open. Multi tool. That should be handy. That should work. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. All right. Let's do this. Let's do this, guys. Let's find out what's behind the door. There's a baby in there? Careful, don't spook her. Yeah, Clem. Oh, yeah. Hey, Clementine. Yeah, your hat. My hat! You found it! I knew you'd find it. You said you would. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Yeah, I'd like, I'd to, like someday. to someday. Maybe a little girl like you. That's nice. You'd be a good daddy. Well, thanks for thanks, finding Clem. your hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. I've pet plenty of Hey there, cows. Andy. Yeah. Um, uh... Danny needs something. Danny needs something again. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Get the fuck out of here, Danny. All right, let's open the door. Guys, okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Oh, shit. How am I supposed to do it? I picked up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. Trying to distract the Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What about those generators? This should keep him busy. Power switch. 
Power switch. Shit. There we go. Anything else? By the way, guys, thank you for watching this series. You know. Thank you for the sports likes, you know, doing this, guys, so we both enjoy it. Alright, if I fuck this up, should keep there, me busy. That should do it. Hmm. It's kind of dangerous, but. Fucking Danny, where do you find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, all. Oh. Ah, oh, son of a. <laughs> All right. No mail coming in or out these days. At least they don't have to worry about bill collectors anymore. All right, that's keeping busy, guys. Now I'm gonna see what's behind that damn door. He's a stick motherfucker. Got this again. Let's keep an eye out. What the hell? Mom, Dad, dinner time! Dinner time. Dinner time. Okay, honey, let's get that. You guys Dad, go on ahead. Dad. Eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. Thanks, Kenny. Alright, guys. Let's see what's behind this bitch. The screws holding it to the door. If I can remove them, I don't even need to deal with the lock. Now remove them. Stop talking. Guys, we got this. They gotta be hiding something big. <clears throat> what is it, Lee? What the fuck? Boy, didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. What the hell is this? What the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So Dude, you see, these guys are fucking cannibals. These guys fucking resorting to cannibalism. I'm sure of it. There's no fucking animals out here. Barely. <laughs> oh, Brenda, you wow. are an angel. Oh, Excuse me, miss. We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. Now go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. Damn. I can eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. They fucking well, cut up Mark. My hands first. Bathroom's right out They're fucking. The that bitch sure fucking cooked up Mark. Nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. That bitch fucking killed Mark. Dude. I swear these bitches. Well, I knew it. Through that thing. I knew it, guys. I knew it. Couldn't trust these fellas. Didn't I tell you guys? These are fucking cannibals. I could use a shave. Gauze pads. Now we're gonna find out for sure. When we see what happened to Mark. Take it easy, Lee. 
Oh shit. Keep walking, Lee. We gotta find Mark. They need so much morphine for the fucking Kids. drug the people. Smart. Musty as hell. I guess someone needed some first aid recently. Huh, where is that cord going? Uh, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. Same. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? I'm telling you guys. I'm 100% sure these guys are fucking cannibals. What the hell? There's a room behind it. This is this is a secret door. Look at the light coming out. I got to get back there. Probably from there, but let's check this side if we can. No, we can't. All right, let's go. Look, you see this, guys? It's a secret door. Is that blood? What the fuck did you guys do to Mark? But Brenda said he was up here resting. I liked him. I liked Mark. Liked him. You guys chopped him up into pieces. Mark. Lee. Mark. Mark. What, what the, the fuck? To your legs, man. They cut his leg up. Don't eat dinner. <laughs> they are fucking cook Close cooking his legs. They are fucking cooking his legs. Go 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 go. Glam. Lee, Jesus, man. Did you find something? It's human meat. Oh, sit your ass down, Lee. This lady has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. It didn't have to be this way. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? Oh, oh, scaring the kids, Lee. What Lee, the fuck are you guys doing? You. Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. What is going on? They're picking us off to trade us meat. You're out of your skull. Mark is upstairs right now with no legs. God damn it. Tell me he's not being eaten right now. Yeah, fucking cannibal. It's true. I knew Everything it. could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We got to think about living. Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Oh, I'm gonna puke. We outnumber you, motherfucker. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. He wasn't dying. Like y'all. Lily, grab a knife! 
Nobody's going anywhere. Fuck. We got lots of use for y'all right here. Fuck, I fucked it up. What the fuck? The fucking what? Put your what? guns down. We're walking you out of go here. Near my fucking right. family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Everyone, everything will be okay. Lee? Lee? I need to get a fucking gun. Oh, now you're going too far. Now you pushed it. Mark? Does Mark Please. become a zombie? Mark! Oh my... That's disgusting. I knew it, guys. I knew we couldn't trust these people. I will tear you fuckers apart with my bare hand. We gotta find another way out of here. Didn't I tell you guys from the start? Fucking bastard! Fucking cannibal fuck. Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the goddamn door down. Are you safe, Glam? It was a person. I ate meat from a person. Does that mean I'm gonna turn into? No, no, Clem, it, it, it doesn't work like that. If he would have stopped us in time... Are you on, blaming me? Now's not the time. You okay, Clementine? They, they didn't hurt you, did they? Mm -mm. Open up! Lee, those psychos have my family, and we're stuck in a damn meat locker. We gotta get the fuck out of here! They're gonna this fucking cook up? This goddamn sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm going to find us a way out of here. Yeah, because only I do something Dad, around this no bitch. Worse than a walker. Dad, please. Salt legs. Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. Please settle down. Oh, I'll rip your goddamn heads up and make you swallow them. I'll, I'll break that damn door down. Dad, you can't get... Uh, uh, Die, Larry. Die. <laughs> Piece of shit. No. Dad, come on. Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead. Somebody help me. Fuck. I ain't helping. If he's dead. He's not dead. No, it has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? How fast he turned? What are you saying? Lily, you have I'm to sorry. Get him. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, <laughs> seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back! Lee! Morning later. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! We can't kill him if he's not dead, Kenny. Remember how hard it was for you to get that monster off of Katya? And Larry's twice his size. It's him or us. Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten, I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. Yeah, it's different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not going to make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. Oh, fucking hell, Kenny. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake up. I think he's still Lee, alive. Is he breathing at all? No. No, I don't think so. Okay, let me take over. Keep checking his pulse. Are you stupid? He's gonna turn. You're putting all of us at risk, you what? son of a don't bitch. Don't do it, Kenny. You're fucking worst Freezely. No! It had to be done. You don't know that. Yes, I do, Lee. And so do you. I was counting on you, man. Fuck you. 
Yeah, everybody's turning against each other. I know. Don't you fucking touch me! Clam. Are you? Too okay? much salt will kill you. Is it over? Yes, for now. But we still need to find a way out of here. No, we go. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Like what? Like bunnies. Um. How about your walkie-talkie? Those pretend talks with your mom and dad. Don't those make you feel better? Sometimes. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? Almost, girl. Yeah. I'm working on it. Almost. Fucking Kenny, man. I don't want to hear it, Lee. You think I like doing what I did? I'm the guy who couldn't bear to watch the family dog get put down. But if we want to survive this shit, we gotta have the balls to do the hard thing. Or at least one of us has got to. You talk a big game, but could you do the hard thing if it was Katja or Dust? Yeah. You come to that. Yeah, I'll find sure. To do with it. For all we know, the Saint John's might have. No, they they need Katya, Remember, she's the whole reason they brought us here. And no doubt they're using Duck as a bargaining chip. I hope you're right. I know I'm right. I just gotta get to him. That's all. He pushed it, Kenny. He was still alive, Lee. He was still alive. He pushed it with me, Kenny. Kenny, he made a bad call. It was premature for sure, but he was trying to keep us safe. Bullshit. He cares about keeping his family safe. He doesn't give a shit about you and he me. He puts his family first, sure. Just like Larry did. That's the way it goes. Larry, I didn't like you, but... I'm sorry, Larry. I tried to save you, bitch. Even though I fucking hated you. Because I'm a good guy. Please. I need to be alone. God knows you deserve time to grieve, Lily. But wipe the blood off your face, bitch. We need to get out of here. It's the only way. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. Like Clementine. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe Fuck. there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Yeah, do you have, have a coin? Mm-mm. Kenny? If we can remove these screws, the AC should come down easily. Um, the coin, the coin. It's not coming off that way. All right, we gotta find something, guys. Kenny, you got a coin? To survive this shit, we got to work together. How do you expect Lily to work with us after what she just saw you do? If she wants to live, she'll work with us. If she doesn't, then the hell with her. Stop being so cold, Kenny. Listen, I need a coin or something. It's important. It could get us out of here. Well, I got nothing. Fuck you. Man. Please, you have a coin? I need oh. to be alone. God knows you deserve get time to Get the fuck grieve. out. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. Yeah. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Yeah. Your permission. I want your blessing, bitch. Do what you have to do. 
Stop being such an asshole. idea which pocket he keeps us change in mm, I'm best bad in this one go. yep two quarters and a dime that should do it just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off so damn it thank you thank you there we go. Easy peasy. Hurry the fuck up, Lee. We don't have all day here. Kenny, you're starting to fucking annoy me. Don't be the second Larry, alright? I like you, you know? Just don't fuck it up. Well, there's our way out, Lee. Clem, get over here. Clementine can fit through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. You gotta do this, girl. You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. I it's know okay you're to be there. scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. We're all scared. You're girl. gonna be fine. You got this. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Please make her open the door. What's your problem, Kenny? Lily, I'm sorry. We gotta go. I know. I just need a minute to say goodbye. <sighs> hey, we're good. Okay? Yeah, this is good. Shit, he's gonna get us all killed. Kenny, if you keep behaving like this, Stay Kenny. here. Take care of Lily, okay? I swear you're gonna I end will. up like Larry. I don't even fucking get it. Need some weapons. Damn. Fucking torture chamber. I told you there was something up in this room. It's a goddamn human slaughterhouse. Alright, let's see you at the next part. Hold up.